Hey there Aquarius, so I am here to do a love reading for the month of February. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you feel inclined to do so, and leave me a comment as well. I am on TikTok every single day, Sage the Intuitive, if you would like to follow me there. Um, let's get started. So we're going to see what's going on in regards to love for Aquarius for the month of February. So this could be anything that's going on. So it doesn't have to be um, if you're in a relationship, if you're not. Um, it could be anything. So we're going to see what is going on in your love life for the month of February for Aquarius. I think some of you guys may be a bit bored when it comes to love right now. May not be feeling it. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see what we're starting with, Aquarius. So right out the gate, um, I see that some of you guys could be dealing with a person that is um, stable, someone who has their own money, or this could be what's coming towards you, someone who is emotionally available, someone who basically um, has all four elements, you know, they have the emotions, they have the passion, they are um, mentally stable, and they're financially stable. So you could have a emperor coming towards you, or that could be the energy that you are um, sitting in. Because um, I think many of you had decided that love just wasn't what you want it right now or just wasn't working for you right now but I see a lot of unions coming together um from how the cards are coming um some of you guys this month will decide just to celebrate with your friends not so much um worry about love and relationships however I think that some of you have been manifesting or wishing on a star for someone to come in that is like this emperor energy someone that is stable someone who will give you what you need, someone who can take control when it comes to love and relationships. Some of you guys could also be healing from something from the past that um, may have put you in a situation that you may have not wanted to be in. Um, now you're deciding to kind of be more of a free spirit, to kind of go with the flow. What happened was there are some um, past energies that needed to end. Maybe there was some third party situation or something, but whatever it was, it needed to end. And some of you guys may have ended a relationship um, recently, or maybe within a couple months. Um, there is something about the stars here. So I feel like a lot of you have really been wishing and manifesting for something to come in. But in the meantime, some of you have been working on your finances coming up here as a nine of pentacles. You want that wish fulfillment you want that um stability i feel like this is some of you really um just working on those things that you needed to work on so that you are financially stable single you didn't need necessarily need anyone um there are some choices that are coming in in regards to love aquarius for you so you're gonna have to make a choice but some of you are deciding not to do that or maybe there is someone in love that you wanted them to choose you and they're not making a choice this really bored you. <laughs> this puts you at this, you know, you're kind of like, yeah, I'm not really feeling it. Um, or maybe you're not feeling the choices that are in front of you because you're looking for um, this lover's energy. You're looking for someone who is passionate. You're looking for someone who will, you know, look at you like you, you are, you know, everything to them. You want something real. And so maybe the options that you have been um, that have been presented to you may not be um, what you want right now. So while it's it's kind of like okay, well you know I'm single. Yeah, I might want to be with someone. Of course I do, but um, I'm bored with the options that I have. So maybe some of you guys are online dating or something. Um, you're going to need to follow your intuition, but some of, you, some of you have really been doing that, which is probably why you're like bored. You know that the options that were presented to you were not what you wanted and you've been protecting your heart um, when it comes to love and relationships. 
Tell me about this lover's situation that is coming. Whoa. All right. So let's see. So love for you has been a burden. It has been stressful for you. Noted. And so you've been very guarded. Um, but someone is coming in towards you really, really fast. Regardless of the factor that you are guarding your heart, this person is going to come in again, someone that is very stable, someone has, who has their stuff together, someone who's going to match you, and they're going to also be passionate and um, ready to give you what you need. And this is going to happen really fast. I think you're, gonna, you're not going to expect this to happen this fast especially with all these other options that you weren't really feeling like that and then this one person is going to come in it could be an earth sign uh, um taurus virgo or capricorn again this is a um, fast energy that's coming in you could have been manifesting this after you walked away from something but whatever it is is happening faster than you may have expected any advice for Aquarius on how to deal with um, February. Continue to have strength. It could be a Leo that you're going to be dealing with, but continue to have strength. Um, this person is going to come in with a lot of love and they're going to come in with an offer. You are deserving of this. You had this good karma coming towards you. This judgment card has been coming out for a lot of people. So you are deserving of this. Um, potentially someone could be watching you. So, again, maybe someone you weren't expecting, but they could be um, watching you. So, let's see what final messages we have for Aquarius. Hill family issues. So, your love life um, benefits as you forgive your parents. So, there was some healing that you needed to do, which I think you were in the process of doing. That's why you were working on your money, loving yourself first, because that's what you were doing. Um, because you could have experienced some deception in the past, but now... Um, you are ready to retreat with someone and then you're going to have some type of reconciliation. So it's going to be someone either from your past or someone from a past life or a soulmate um, that is going to come in towards you, Aquarius. So that is what I have for you as of right now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment if this means anything to you at all. I appreciate all your likes, your shares, and your subscriptions and definitely appreciate your comments and I look forward to seeing them. You guys be safe. Um, don't forget I'm on TikTok, Sage the Intuitive, if you want to get messages every single day. All right, take care. See you soon.